Hello there my purple banditos and welcome back to our Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red. I'm Purple Rodri. Last time we took down the third Elite Four member, Agatha. It was a little bit stressful, but we knocked it out. Today, I am ready for us to make our way into the fourth room. So let's keep on walking and see what awaits us. It must be someone very important because the game is not letting me control our character. This is exciting time, guys. And whoa, it looks like there's some dude in the cape here. Now, from the Fang statues, I'm gonna go ahead and guess he's a dragon type trainer. I listen to you guys' suggestions. I have a chew up in front, so let's go ahead and talk to him. Ah, I've heard about you, Rodri. I lead the Elite Four. You can call me Lance, the Dragon Trainer. You know that dragons are mythical Pokemon. They're hard to catch and race, but their powers are superior. They're virtually indestructible. There's no being clever with them. Well, are you ready to lose? Your League Challenge ends with me, Rodri. Here we go, Rodri versus Lance. So let's go ahead and take on Lance, guys, the fourth Elite Four member, the Dragon-type Master. He's going to open up with his five Pokemon. He's going to send out a Gyarados. I have Achu ready to go, so great call on your guys' part. Thanks to all you guys who gave me those suggestions. And I think this is going to be a very fun and exciting battle. Hopefully not as many crazy things as, uh, you know, happened with uh, Agatha back there. But we'll see how this is going to go. Oh, mother fudge. Did we really miss our Thunder? Oh, come on, please. Thank you. Let's go for the Thunderbolt then. This should do a lot of damage to this Gyarados. It'd be kind of nice if we could pop the full restores now too. It'd be actually really, really nice um, if we could pop the full restores. But it's okay. Super effective. Gyarados is going to be down. All right, let's see. Who's coming out next? Who's coming out next, guys? This is kind of fun. This is kind of fun. Next up is a Dragonair. Uh, and this is where I am going to begin switching. I'm going to go ahead and send out Glaze. As you guys know, Glaze is an Ice type. Uh, should be absolutely crushing these guys with Ice Beam. And we also have Doki, who knows a couple Ice type moves. Now, this is probably one of the toughest battles we're going to do. So let's hope for the best here. Safeguard. Wow, really? That's what you're going to do? Okay. Then this guy already knows we have ice, you know, ice moves coming. The dude knows it. The dude feels it. He's like, yeah, I'm going to try to, you know, prevent everything. Even with the safeguard, we still took down Dragonair. Let's keep on trucking then and see who's coming at us next. Next is an Aerodactyl. Ooh, okay. Well, that sounds like a blast. Yeah. You know what? I'll keep Blaze out for the Aerodactyl. That's okay. Oh, it's okay. Let's see what we can do to this Aerodactyl. I think I'm going to go for another Ice Beam. We're just going to keep the Ice Beams rolling, dude. That's what's going to work for us, guys. The Ice Beams, we're just going to keep them going. That did a lot. Dang, super effective. Really? Let's see how much the Ice Beam should do on this thing. It should do a good amount, I'm pretty sure. You know, it, it all these Dragon Pokemon or whatever should go down pretty quickly. All right, there we go. It's down. See you later. Super effective. I think it was like times four or some effectiveness on that guy. That dude's ridiculous, but hey, we gained a few levels, and uh, let's see who's coming out next. Dragonair. We're doing awesome right now, though, guys. I can't believe we're actually doing this well. Uh, it's actually going a lot easier than I expected it to be. I thought this was going to be a little bit more of a challenge, and I also thought he had two Dragonites. Uh, I guess I was wrong. I don't know why I was expecting him to have two Dragonites, but that's okay, guys. Let's see who his final Pokemon is, and there we go. That's the Dragonite. All right, so this is the big boy. This is his big boy. This is the biggest challenge, and now we are absolutely outleveled. Ooh, the Outrage, it might take us down. It might just... No, good. Ice Beam, let's see if we can take this guy down one hit. He's probably really tanky. There's no way we take him down one hit, right? Right! There we have it. Wow, let me have it. Like, I did not expect that, but we defeated this guy. We gained a bunch of XP, and that was an easy, easy battle. We defeated the Elite Four Lance, guys. That's it. I hate to admit it, but you are a Pokemon Master. We got 6,000 for winning, and thank you. Thank you so much. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you, Rodri. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge left. There is one more trainer to face. His name is Soli. He beat the Elite Four before you. He is the real Pokemon League champion. Wow, guys. I still can't believe my dragons lost to you, Rodri. All right, well, with that, guys, it seems like we aren't the champion just yet. And we have one battle ahead of us. One battle left. Leave it all behind. It all comes down to this. So next time, guys, we will be making our way into the final room and taking on the champion of Kanto. If we defeat him, we are the champions. Woo! It's been a long battle. It's been pretty crazy. Four elite, more, four elite four members down. No more to go. If you guys have any tips, let me know. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye. We're coming for you, Sully.